Find the roots of the quadratic equation x square plus 5x minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6 equal to 0 where alpha is a constant. Question is to find the roots. Here variable is x right and alpha is a constant. So question is to find values of x. First step consider the given quadratic equation. Compare this with general equation and find the values of a, b and c. A equal to coefficient of x square 1, B is equal to coefficient of x 5, C equal to constant minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6. Find sum and product. Sum is equal to B equal to 5. Product is equal to A into C equal to 1 into minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6. Find the numbers. In this case, if the coefficient of x square is 1, then the numbers will be the terms of the product. Here terms are alpha plus 1 and alpha plus 6. Next to find the sign. For finding the sign, consider sum. Here sum is equal to plus 5. That is, sum results a positive value which implies here the greatest number sign should be positive. Here greatest number is six, alpha plus 6 right. So it should be positive and alpha plus 1 should be negative then only you will get 5. The numbers are minus alpha plus 1 and alpha plus 6. Sum is equal to minus alpha plus 1 plus alpha plus 6 open the bracket minus alpha minus into minus minus 1 plus alpha plus 6 minus alpha plus alpha 0 minus 1 plus 6 5 sum is equal to 5 and product, and product minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6 next split b as minus alpha plus 1 plus alpha plus 6 x square plus in place of 5 we can substitute the sum of these numbers into x minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6 equal to 0. Now open the bracket and multiply with x. x square plus minus alpha plus 1 x plus alpha plus 6x six minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6 equal to 0. Now open this bracket x square plus minus minus alpha plus 1x plus into plus plus alpha plus 6x minus alpha plus 1 into alpha plus 6 equal to 0. Group it and take the common terms outside. In x square minus alpha plus 1 x, x is common. Take it out. So, x into remaining x minus alpha plus 1. Plus, now in next two terms, alpha plus 6 is common. Take it out. Alpha plus 6 into now remaining x minus alpha plus 1 equal to 0. Now x minus alpha plus 1 is common. Take it out. x minus alpha plus 1 into x plus alpha plus 6 equal to 0. That is product of two terms equal to 0 which implies either first term that is x minus alpha plus 1 is equal to 0 or second term equal to 0 that is x plus alpha plus 6 equal to 0. Now find the values of x. x minus alpha plus 1 equal to 0 implies x equal to alpha plus 1 
minus sign becomes plus when you are taking to RHS or x plus alpha plus 6 equal to 0 implies x equal to minus alpha plus 6. So here two values are alpha plus 1 and minus alpha plus 6.